And disturbing and concerning. That's how the Waukesha County District Attorney describes the actions of an 18 year old babysitter. The woman is charged with killing a Sussex family's dog while watching over their four year old child. Sam Kramer brought you this story last night. He's here in studio with what happened in court today. New information, Sam. Heather Ben and staff, the criminal charge before Kylie Sonneman is a class I felony, that being the lowest level felony in state law. But at her first court appearance today, the commissioner was clear that label doesn't cover up the violence involving this dog. State of Wisconsin versus, I believe that's Kylie Sonneman. She expected to hear her name called next month at her high school graduation. Instead, it's a Waukesha County Court Commissioner doing the honors Monday for 18 year old Kylie Sonneman. This is just a, a very troubling situation all the way around, Your Honor. The criminal complaint filed Monday says Sonneman was babysitting a four year old girl last Thursday at the family's home in Sussex. When the parents returned, they couldn't find their eight year old Chihuahua Batman. Sonneman even helps look for him. But Waukesha County District Attorney Sue Opper says it was Sonneman who killed him. We have an act of violence that was uh, perpetrated perhaps in the presence of a four year old child. Family found Batman's remains Friday, hidden beneath a pile of blankets, pillows, and stuffed animals in their 11 year old daughter's bedroom. Deputies say Batman had a stab wound and a bag tied over his head. They found a pair of scissors with possible blood and fur on them in a dresser drawer. Commissioner, as you know, you're able to consider affirmative defenses. Her public defender argued Monday the dog was biting Sonneman. She told detectives there was a lot of drama going on and that when she gets mad, she lashes out. The criminal complaint adds she doesn't remember doing anything. So is it violent? It sure is. Commissioner David Herring set her bond at $15,000 cash and ordered she have no contact with the victims, no weapons, and no unsupervised time with any minor or pet. Sonneman is due back in court next week for a preliminary hearing. District Attorney Sue Opper says it's possible she could face more charges because the Sheriff's Department is still investigating. Ben?